In this video, we will discuss the isometric projection problem number 50. The question is given like this a rectangular slab of base uh, 100 mm into 80 mm and height 30 mm has full depth coaxial square hole of side of 40 mm such that one of the sides of the square is parallel to the top or side of the rectangle to draw the isometric projection of this combination. So if the first object bottom or the only one object is that is a rectangular slab is there. Center we need to make a hole. First we will construct the rectangular slab. The dimensions are 180. We will start with 100. 100 enter 30. 80 enter 150. Then again 100 enter minus 150. Then 80 enter minus 30. So after that they given the thickness go to the corner give the thickness 30. Enter 30. Angle is minus 80. So then uh, go to move option. Switch on the copy. Select the line from the top, pick it and place it to the remaining two corners. And then hold the control, select these two edges and from the top, pick it and place it to the bottom. Then uh, after finishing this, go to the uh, line, uh, the top square hole, they given 40. So select the line 40, enter 30, then 40, enter 150, then uh, 40, enter minus 150, then 40, enter minus 30. Okay, next, uh, so we need to give the whole throat hole, they given throat hole means the thickness of the slab will be considered. Uh, so the height uh, they given 30, so enter 30, angle is minus 90. And same way, these front two corners also we need to take the same. And uh, this side also we can take it. And then draw the line uh, to these two edges because and the remaining we need to trim this because these are the portions will not be seen inside so that's why only this portion should be kept after making this arrangement to go to the line normal and draw the a diagonal line to the top face of this and here also top face of this because these two top faces comes here the hole will be go inside then go to move switch off the copy select this uh, solid then pick from the midpoint and place it at the midpoint after placing to the midpoint, we need to delete uh, the diagonal lines and uh, uh, the problem is going to be finished. And then last step, we need to take isometric uh, scale that is 0 0.814 and enter and click it. Like this, the problem is solved. 